the headlines. The inauguration ceremony of the Temple of Matters of Pregnant No. 1. The groundbreaking ceremony of the restoration of the national architectural and artistic relics of Hip Thinh Cung Kerang Together. The groundbreaking ceremony of the Geological Survey Student Project for the preparation of in depth research reports of the tracking project combined with product recovery of the Encounter Maritime Channel. Hello, and it's good to see you back here in this edition of Continuous and Top News today. The inauguration ceremony of the Temple of Matters of Regiment No. 1, Umin, under military zone 9, at Road No. 9, Thành Thới, area of the world, get on over the street, can today took place on the afternoon of April 20th. The temple started construction on September 18, 2023, with an area of nearly 2,000 square meters, a total investment of more than 10 billion Vietnamese dome. The project is a man temple with an area of 200 square meters, including the space for worshiping martyrs, the shrine of Uncle Ho and Uncle Tom place in the center, and the ceremony space. The construction of the temple in Kansas City, the center of the Mekong Delta region, is very convenient for a large number of people from all corners to come here to light incense, commemorate the martyrs, and contribute to the education of tradition of remembering the origin. The project was completed as expected by compatriots, comrades, and the liaison board of the regiment. At the ceremony, letters from the center, military zone 9, Gantha City and provinces performed a ribbon cutting ceremony to inaugurate the temple, then offer incense to the seniors and veteran revolutionaries and commemorated heroes and war martyrs of the regiment. The management board of Hip Thinh Cung Kerang Pagilder on April 20th morning organized the groundbreaking ceremony of the restoration of the national architectural and artistic relics of Hip Thinh Cung Kerang Pagilder. Hip Thiên Cung Karang Pagelder was classified as the National Architectural and Artistic Relic by the Ministry of Culture, Sports and Tourism in 2017. Over nearly 170 years, Hip Thiên Cung Pagelder has retained the traditional cultural architecture of the Chinese people. Not only a religious base, Hip Thiên Cung Pagelder is also an attractive attraction for domestic and foreign tourists. Currently, many deteriorated work items need to be renovated to preserve and promote the value of architectural and artistic relics, serving religious needs and creating attractions for visitors to Kanto City. Hip Thiên Cung Karang Pagelder project to renovate four main items, a total investment of over 6 billion Vietnam dong from mobilization sources. Construction is expected in eight months. On April 20th morning, in Kulayum Township, Shoptang Province, APM Land Asia Pacific Corporation held a groundbreaking ceremony of the Geological Survey Student Project for the preparation of in depth research reports of the trenching projects combined with product recovery of the Encounter Maritime Channel. The contractor of trolling, surveying, and making reports of the project is Southern Natural Resources and Environment Company Limited. The project is constructed along the two sides of the Nanghou River Maritime Channel, the section from Bowie O to Bowie 25, with a length of about 37 km, about 100 meters from two sides of the channel to the outside of the channel. In Yinghai Township, Travin Province, and Gula Yung Township, Shopdang Province, the project has a scale of 40 boreholes. The depth of each bore is about 10 meters, and the diameter for each bow is about 75 to 110 millimeters. Construction time is expected in 60 days. Chairman and General Director of IBM Land Asia Pacific Group, Joy Stock Company, Nguyễn Mạnh Linh ensured that the project could be implemented on schedule, ensuring maritime safety, security, fire prevention, and environmental pollution prevention. Also on April 20th morning, Kansas City Learning Promotion Association and Asia Foundation jointly organized the first scholarship award to 101 female students of high schools in Kansas City. Each student selected for the scholarship could be supported two times a year with a total scholarship value of 4.4 million Vietnam dong. 
the Angel Foundation Scholarship Program aims to create opportunities for girls to meet and interact with professionals in the field of human resources and successful female examples in STEM fields, science, technology, engineering, mathematics. At the same time, it provides important information about labor market trends in the common years, future opportunities, as well as skills and knowledge needed to succeed, contributing to shaping future career choices. On April 20th morning, the Grassroots Trade Union of Kansas City School of Politics organized the sports attached construction sites and planting trees in gratitude to Uncle Ho on the 49th anniversary of the Southern Liberation National Reunification and May Day. This is an exchange between school staff and students and is organized annually by the school to create a joyful and exciting atmosphere in learning and teaching as well as in training of sports. On this occasion, the Grassroots Trade Union of the City School of Politics aggregated and attacked the size of the volleyball court project in Area 8 and Ward. This is the model of skillful mass mobilization at the municipal level. The project has a budget of more than 97 million Vietnamese stone contributed by school staff and students. The Crestwood Trade Union of Kansas City Radio and Television coordinated to organize the Four Heroes Football Tournament on the morning of April 20th. Participating in the tournament were teams that can support Joe Stock Company, Vic Fab Import and Export Trading Joe Stock Company, Southern Branch, Southwest Logistics Limited Liability Company, and Midnam Mechanical Limited Liability Company, Kansas City Radio and Television. The first prize results went to the Joint Forks of Southwest Logistics Limited Liability Company and Minna Mechanical Limited Liability Company. The football tournament practically celebrates major holidays of the nation as well as an opportunity to exchange and promote the sports movement to improve health among cadres, officials and employees. Ladies and gentlemen, Kentucky City has just organized the 11th Southern Pop Case Festival in 2024. This yearly cultural and culinary event aims to draw tourists to the city while also promoting the pro and reservation of Southern Pop Case. Additionally, local tourism organizations have been providing numerous incentives to visitors on this occasion. Many foreign and domestic visitors to the city choose to stay at Gong Khun Resort because of its expansive green space and proximity to Hau River. Recently, the bungalow area and the hotel area have seen improvements in terms of space and animities, which is characteristic of this distinctively constructed resort. The unit in particular provided numerous inducements to visitors to prolong their stay during the Southern Folk Cake Festival, notably all visitors staying at this resort on this particular date are eligible for a room rate reduction up to 50%. In addition, our resort is offering a buffet program to commemorate the Folk Cake Festival and combine it with the holiday of April 30, May Day. During this time of the year, a significant number of guests reserve hotels. Nevertheless, room capacity is available until the end of the festival. In response to the 2024 Southern Folk Cake Festival, numerous local tourist destinations offered a variety of incentives to encourage guests to engage in more activities. To draw tourists, Mekan Ecotourism Village in Mekan Commune Funding District offered a variety of enticing programs. Specifically, there was a 20% discount of the combination of touring the tourist village plus fruit garden, plus indulging in fruits and folk sweets, and 50% off entrance tickets for groups of eight or more when reservations were made in advance. Specifically, the unit also provided a 20% discount on the combination of sightseeing admission tickets plus unlimited rainbow slide mats. Meikhan Resort offers special pricing for its guests, with rooms starting at just 699,000 Vietnam Dong.
In addition, we provide other services like the cake making and hu tiêu making program, which enables visitors to experience and produce their own products under the supervision of artisans in craft villages. They're guaranteed human resources for the holidays, and the person that we have is competent. The 11th Southern Folk Cake Festival 2024 was held at the Binh Thuy District Plaza from April 17 to 21st. This major festival takes place in the city every year to actively support the traditional cultural values and food culture of Cần Thơ, the Mekong Delta region, as well as other provinces and cities across the country. With so many engaging events, the festival looked to be a popular gastronomic and cultural destination for visitors to Cần Thơ City. Did with a forecast, don't sort of dub this edition of continuous. If you want to watch again in this bulletin, please visit our website, control tv.vn. And thanks for being with us. Goodbye, and see you next time.